Okay, we're back again in the garage. Um, just another tip. I've been looking at the, the original combustion chamber and I've been looking at uh, the production versions. Uh, the whole pattern looks very, very similar. The only thing they've done different is they've, in this in this front flange they've added 112 holes, 56 around the outside and 56 around the inside. Now these holes are quite small but I'm not sure of the exact size so if you try it you'll have to start at a milli, I don't think they're less than a milli, start at a milli and then don't go more than 1.5 so one milli to 1.5. Try them at a milli first and then keep opening them up in stages. Uh, the distance seems to be about a third. So if you divide this third, third, third uh, and put your row holes like that, it, it uh, that should be about right. Like I say, 56 in each row. So there's quite a lot of fine holes. Now the only other, the pattern looks very similar. Also, what I've noticed is they put the they put the vaporising tube between rows three and four, the final row. So the fi that's the final row that holds. There's some more here I haven't drawn on. So it wants to go between the third and fourth row, uh, like that. Uh, also, they've missed off this little hole there, but I don't think that's that's worth bothering about it. If you've done it, you've done it. Don't bore it. Don't sweat it but um, they haven't got that extra hole in above this uh, other hole. Uh, another thing is what they've done on the outside which again I don't think is a problem and with having the flaps on the outside you can you can fine-tune it with altering them flap sizes. They are open two and a half millimeters uh, which you check with the drill uh, flat down on the flap and just catching the inside when it when it goes through at the angle that the flap is. That's the two and a half milli. That's a standard. Now you might have to just fine tune that a bit. Uh, you may have to close it a bit. But again, I'd, something I'd experiment with and, and perhaps do it in point one increments. Uh, and just make sure there's uh, gaps on the outer chamber. There's a, a saw cut or a grinder grinding edge to it. Uh, I can't remember the spacing now. Um, but just make sure them are clear and a proper ground groove whatever it says because that there's air meant to go in there and that keeps the, the can from burning away so that's important that. If you folded them in a bit it's worth just opening the slot again to the size because otherwise you're not letting the air through on the skin. The, the skin cooling her uh, that'll help the, the can survive. Uh, so that's that's the only thing I've noticed recently, and it, I think it's worth trying them two rows of holes. I think that might uh, be the final thing that'll will make them run right with the original combustor. Okay for now.